Do you need to use it for the rest of your life to keep the hair growing ongoing? Well, that is one of those things as well. Is this going to be the ingredient that you can just use for a period of four weeks and then your hair follicles function new again for the rest of your days? Or is it going to be something that there's going to be a degree of maintenance? Odds are, like anything, there is going to be a degree of maintenance if you have a chronic condition which is male or female pattern hair loss. It may be though that you can use this at an incremental level so you can use it less frequently than you may have to with traditional medicines like finasteride or minoxidil. Again, this is going to come down to what they find over the longer term studies on larger population bases in their phase three trials and beyond. Because ultimately, if you've got a chronic condition, unless you're switching off the genes which lead to that chronic condition, it's going to be very hard for us to expect anything to have a one-time dose approach or one-time effect on the body even vaccines often require boosters and top-ups so i would anticipate that it's probably going to need to be something that you will use ongoing but possibly at lower amounts and a reduced cadence than you would with things like finasteride or minoxidil